Hi from Laundry Talk. Today I have a special video for you for two reasons. Number one is today is National Best Friends Day and I want to give a shout out to my awesome best friend, twin dude, comadre, you know who you are, Denise. I want to give you a shout out today for being there for me from like the first day that we met, we became cool close friends and I have a few more reasons why. Second reason I am doing this video is because I want to say to everyone, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for helping me reach 1,000 subscribers. Thank you so much, everyone. I love you so much. Thank you for supporting me. Every time I put a video, you guys are like writing comments, sending me text messages and um, calling me and letting me know, hey, I like this about your video or giving me suggestions. I'm open for suggestions. Put it down in the comments if you have some suggestions for future videos and just giving me your overall support your likes your comments your views everything is just highly appreciated so thank you thank you thank you for 1000 subscribers super excited i'm um, sorry about my voice uh it was hot outside i just finished working not that long ago i was out with the kids and then come inside and it was like the air conditioner so kind of messed up my voice a bit it happens it's okay i'm not sick or anything just my voice a little bit um, off. So yes, back to the best friends day. Today is a special day because obviously I celebrate my friend every single day. I celebrate all my friends every day. So mainly this video is about my best friend, Denise, my bestest friend. However, I do have other best friends. It's just that we're closer in distance and we just have a little extra bond and a little extra things in common. And so we have stayed together, living close together and being in each other's lives a little more than some of my other best friends. But I still love you guys. I do really, really, really do. Um, my best friend, Liza Nice, which is the, mainly the reason of the video, is that we have been friends for over 20 years. Yes, over 20 years. And I feel that the reason we have been friends for so long has been because we have had great communication, respect for each other, and respect for our beliefs and our preferences, either on how we carry out our lives or how we are as parents, for example. Uh, we have worked together for many years or had worked together for many years, and I feel like we also got to know each other more. We're also very open with each other. It's not just like best friends and you tell each other things, but for example, we're like we're not here to criticize each other. We're here to help each other grow in every aspect that we can. So communicating and letting us know to each other like what bothers us. Another main thing that has kept us being best friends is that we don't put our um, problems or our, our things as more important than the other person. And you have to be very careful with that because yeah, we all have things going on. We all have um, things that we like, we don't like, and stuff that happens in our lives. Uh, mommy, but when- what are you doing? What are you doing, mommy? What am I doing? I'm recording a video about your Nina. Okay, this is what you're doing. What are you doing, mommy? What are you doing, mommy? I'm recording a video. You want to say hi? Hello, hello. You want yellow? Okay, so come say hi, and then you're going to get ice, yellow. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> All right, your sister's going to get you some ice. Okay. For those of you that do know me, you know that when my daughter wants to come out in the video, I don't really mind, and I don't. no one has ever minded before having her in. I feel like as a, as a mom, as a parent, uh, these are natural things that happen and i just feel like you know you keep rolling just like you keep rolling in life you keep rolling on youtube so that's why she's in the video now um so while that's being handled by her sister let's continue so yeah so my friend and i we uh really respect each other's times each other's time and we also respect each other's um, opinions so we are you know we tell each other things we have very rarely gotten um upset with each other to the point that it might take us like a few days or a week to let the other person know um why we got upset but eventually talk about it say things don't let um those feelings harvest don't let those feelings grow roots in your heart and have that against the other person so that's a good tip anyway uh the reason why I'm so happy to celebrate this National Best Friends Day today is also because my friend has been there for me in the good, the bad, and the ugly. She has been there uh, for me when I didn't have to eat. She was there for me 
through the times that, you know, through graduations from school, through hardships, through the births of all my kids. She has just, um, you know, been there to support me, to call my attention when it's needed, to let me know when I need to take care of myself, as she's been doing a lot lately. Um, <laughs> she, she conspires with my children against me. But anyway, you know, having a best friend is so cool. And if you can find one person in this life, one best friend in this life, I think like you're lucky. I really do because finding someone you can trust, finding someone that you love, like a sister, like a brother, you know, like someone you can feel comfortable and be yourself around. Some people don't have that in a whole lifetime. So I am very fortunate to have my best friends in my life, my friends in general, and the great support system that I have. Everything is not peachy and great. You know, there are some times when it's not, but just getting through that, making it to the other side with your friends, with your um, support group, support system. That's what counts. I love you guys. I hope you have a wonderful um, best friends day. If you have any comments about your awesome friends, put it down in the comments. If you want me to do um, any other videos about my best friend, and, best friend and I. Um, also, season one of the Laundry Talk Show is on my playlist and you can see her there because she um, does some appearances, some guest appearances on season one of my um, interviews on parenting and daycare and things like that. So, love you guys, have a wonderful day. Don't forget to smile.